Okay, so here I'm gonna show you guys how you can get more consistent with your draw shots. A lot of people can actually draw the ball really well, but they can't control the speed. So I'm gonna give you a little bit of tip here. Set up the balls in the manner that they are. Um, and I want you to try and make the one in draw up here by the third diamond. And the goal to control the speed is to hit it as soft as you can. So when you're hitting a draw shot soft, you actually have to hit it lower. So it's a little bit more, I guess, dangerous, you could say. But once you get used to hitting the cue ball lower without miscuing, your percentages of actually getting the cue ball to stop where you want it to are going to go way up. So for example, on this shot, I'm going to have to cut the one a little bit to create a little bit of an angle. So I'm going to cheat the pocket and I'm going to draw up here and I'm going to hit it with a little bit longer stroke. Um, you don't want a short jabby stroke because that's when the miscues come in. So we're going to use um, a decent sized bridge, a little bit longer stroke, go low on the cue ball, and we're going to try and focus on our speed and freeze to the rail. Obviously freezing to the rail is really, really low percentage, but if you practice this shot maybe 20 or 30 times a day for a week, I guarantee your control of the draw shot is going to get a lot better. So practice it from the second diamond, put the cue ball in the same spot every time. And then once you get comfortable with that shot, you can actually move it back to the third diamond, right? And then you can bridge off the rail. So you're gonna work on different distances and stuff like that. So I'm gonna show you guys the first version and then once you perfect this, you can use different length draw shots. So it's again, long and smooth, good tip position. I'm gonna try and draw back to this third diamond here. Okay, so that's pretty good. So what you're really trying to do is use a longer stroke, hit it really soft, and when you hit the ball softer, you're gonna have more revolutions of the cue ball because you're hitting it lower, and it's actually a lot easier to control the distance that the ball draws back. Good luck, guys.